Hello everyone, I'm Santiago Santiago and today I'm going to be doing a quick tutorial to show you how to uninstall your drivers and cleanly reinstall them or if you're getting a new GPU and want to dis disable the drivers and install the new ones. So let's get started right away. First follow the link down in the description and download this software which is called DDU or Display Driver Uninstaller. So just follow the link down in the description, download it, extract the contents of the program and you'll get this. So just double click on it and once you do so it will say DDU has detected that you're not in safe mode. For a better cleanup without issues it is recommended that you reboot into safe mode. So we're going to go into safe mode, we close DDU, we open this start button. As you can see here, I already have the NVIDIA driver and the AMD driver. That doesn't matter, that's for later. So just open the start menu, hold shift, and while you hold shift, click on restart. And, whoa, the computer will just restart and say, well, it won't restart, it will say just this. Click on troubleshoot, advanced options, startup settings, and it says here, restart to change Windows options such as, and here it says safe mode. So we click restart. Now we'll get a little screwed up. As you can see, it's restarting. That's why it says no signal. Give it one second. If it takes too long, I'll just fast forward the video, but it should be very quick. But yeah, this is necessary or it is very recommended. Give me one second. We press four. So we get safe mode, as you can see here. Press the 4 button on your keyboard. And as I was saying, this is recommended because it will make a better cleanup of your drivers in case there's something just being interrupting that. So we get a complete cleanup without issues. I just do this, very important. So okay, it's restarting again into safe mode. And you get a very low resolution image. As you can see, this looks terrible. Doesn't matter, we're in safe mode. And let me see if I can zoom in. Yes, I can. Fantastic. We open DDU. Once again here, display driver installer. Okay, as you can see here, now it says RX570, graphic series, blah, blah, blah. It's because we have the RX570 drivers installed. So we select GPU here in this menu. And since we have an AMD driver installed, it's just select AMD. If you have an NVIDIA driver installed, select NVIDIA. And okay, this is important. You have three options here. If you're having, it says here, if you install a new graphics card, you want to just shut down the PC after the cleanup, click here. So just the, delete the drivers and shut down the PC so you can swap graphics cards. And here it says clean and restart. I use this most of the time if I'm having issues with a driver or installing a, an updated driver on the same GPU. In this case, I'll just update to the new AMD driver. So I'm just going to restart and keep the same GPU in the system. So we click here, clean and restart. Okay, it's doing all the good stuff there, deleting the drivers, the GPU drivers. Again, if you're doing swapping from an NVIDIA GPU to an AMD GPU or vice versa, click on clean and shut down. That'll just clean the driver, shut down the PC and you can get remove the GPU and put the new one or whatever. Okay, it's done. It's restarting the PC now. And we should be getting right into Windows after this without any GPU drivers installed. Okay, one second, guys. As always, it takes some time. Okay, the, <laughs> the capture card didn't like that. That's okay. It usually happens. Nothing weird going on, of course. Okay, almost into Windows now. Give it one more second. <laughs> and we're into Windows again without safe mode. So since we have an AMD GPU, we're going to just install the latest AMD drivers that I already had installed, downloaded, better said, in my system. If you have an NVIDIA GPU installed, click here on the NVIDIA driver if you, download, if you downloaded the driver already. So let's just open this. In my case, I'm installing drivers for the AMD card. Okay, we click run and just install the driver. As usual, you have a very low resolution as you can see here because it doesn't know what is my native res the native resolution of the monitor. 
Okay. Almost there. And okay, after this, the GPU drivers will be installed. You cleanly disabled your, sorry, you cleanly uninstalled your drivers and put new ones into your system. This hopefully solves any of the problems you're running into with some games or whatever, or if you're getting a new GPU. I do this each time I get a new graphics card in the system. So yeah, this I do this all the time. So hopefully this helps you out. I'm not going to show you how to install the driver because that's very simple. Just click next, next, next. Yeah, express install, whatever. I don't install, I, sorry, I don't install RE Live. So yeah, this is the simplest thing to do. So I'm not going to explain this. Once this finishes, just restart your system and it's ready to go. So thank you guys for watching this to the point video and see you next time. As you can see now, no signal, that's because it's detecting the new graphics card and it's putting the native resolution. Let me see. Okay, almost there. And as you can see now, we have the native resolution and the drivers are installed, so just restart the PC and you're done. Thank you so much for watching and see you next time.